What's poppin' y'all? This white butterfly ascension. Coming to give y'all another reading for the next 48 hours for my collectives. Hope y'all had a good holiday. Everybody was safe and blessed. With that being said, let's get into this reading. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Check out my TikTok. Help my channel grow. Check out my wish list off of Etsy. Check out my website. Show me some love. Appreciate y'all support. With that being said, show me what I need to see. Universe, spirit, guides, angels. For the next 48, show me what I need to see for my collectors for the next 48. Show me what I need to see for the collectors for the next 48. Let it be great. Oh, that was two. Oh, three of cups. Ace of coins. I see that. I can see that better. So we got celebration coming in. Maybe there's celebration. Because we got the new year about to come in. Or maybe we got celebration. Maybe with Mardi Gras. Some of y'all's, for those of y'all who know what Mardi Gras is, or if you're from New Orleans, or you might be just about to have a party. Bring the new year in right. A lot of harmony, celebration, maybe with a cancer. Maybe with the earth sign. Maybe there's been a, a decision made with a third party situation, maybe with an earth sign. Maybe you don't no longer want to juggle and you have made your decision. Maybe you made your decision to be with a Leo. You see, that's a strength card. Eight means infinity. Maybe you about to celebrate with this Leo. Maybe you decided to leave a earth sign. To be with a Leo. I don't know. Let's see what's going on, my collectives. With 333 on the clock when I said that. That's confirmation. Maybe you're getting ready to go travel to see this woman to show that you have made up your mind. Show me what else I need to see. Clarify this real quick. See now, that's two of coins on top of this three of cups. So we went from celebration with this third party. Now you only want to celebrate with two people. This man. Wants to celebrate. Again, we got a sun in the background rising. Looks like he's holding the world. And all these cups, I mean, oh, see. Maybe a water sign that's making this decision. But there's green right here, green right here, and green right here. So maybe. This Cancer Pisces 
crap. I'm sorry. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio has made a decision with the earth sign and decided to leave this earth sign for a fire sign. Aces also represents one new beginnings. This is all in order. Two of coins and three of cups. So maybe this decision is made <clears throat> by the new year. Maybe this decision has been made. And maybe he's working on his money. So he can go towards this new beginning. Because he's walking on water to get towards the sun. Maybe it might be at, in dawn, at dawn, this person is leaving. Maybe got an epiphany. Let's see. Clarify this ace of coins. Clarify the piece of coins from my collectors. Clarify the piece of coins. It's ace of coins and queen of coins. So maybe he's looking at her. She's looking at him in the right direction. They both have green on. Maybe this person has earth and water in their charts. This person is st stable. They know what they want. They're on the same path. She wears her crown around her head and he holds his own down. They both have a circle, like the circle of life. Maybe you give him the strength to move forward. Maybe he sees this new beginning with you and he's tired of being in this Three of Cups energy. He's made a decision. Over this earth sign. Bottom of the deck, Queen of Cups. And that's what you don't see coming. Maybe this water sign is emotional, devious, doesn't like to show emotions. They got one cup right here. And they got the three cups right here. Maybe this person had you emotional at one time. But you finally found the strength to leave them. Because it's New Year. This new year, you're tired of celebrating with someone that doesn't bring you happiness anymore. And if you gotta travel to the person that makes you happy, you've made the decision. Maybe it could be 
with the earth sign or someone that has earth in their chart. Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. Clarifying this two of cards. And they're coming in fast. It's a water sign. Six nine, six nine. It's a water sign. So this water sign has made a decision. And he doesn't care about tangible items anymore. He just wants to leave. Leave his home, leave his chaos in a rush, in a hurry. Maybe at one time it was celebration within his home, but now it's a lot of troubled waters. Trouble waters and problems. Trying to get y'all to see this car good. All that turmoil, look at the water all rushing. And this man rushing on his chariot. He's rushing and he's right next to this woman. She's facing that way, he's facing towards her. Just like this piece of coins for this new beginning that he wants to have with this earth sign where he sees material, financial gain and blessings, abundantness, where he's emotionally fulfilled because he hasn't been emotionally fulfilled where he's leaving from. He has been in the hangman position but has made a decision. And the hangman is 12, one plus two is three. And this is a three. This is an eight. With this two, That means you have completion. You're ready for completion on this journey. You're ready for this new beginning. Blessings and abundance. Maybe this water sign is going to travel at night. Show me what else I need to see for this chariot. That's confirming. That's 10 again. So that's 10. And that's 10 together. So, this water sign, maybe earth sign, but definitely a water sign, has made a decision to go with this fire sign. Even though this fire sign may be defensive, maybe have been betrayed a lot, both of these men are naked. Maybe it's a same sex relationship, male or female. Clarify this ace of coins. You got the five of swords. And I said clarify this ace of coins. So that's change coming with this earth sign. 
maybe this earth sign had water, water in their chart. But this queen of coins is definitely a Taurus. Maybe a Sagittarius. But there's a change in the situation. He has four swords pointing down and one sword pointing up. So he's dropping his defensives. Because he's tired of feeling beat up within this relationship. So we got five, which is change, and 10, which is completion. And two tens means there's definitely completion in a situation, completion maybe in a job, definitely a relationship. Maybe you don't wanna collaborate with this person anymore because you feel mentally in your head and you're ready for a change. That's why you're rushing from this home. Clarify this five of swords. Got this fire again. So, the five of swords is clarifying the seven of wands. So, you're being strategic and creative when it comes to this fire sign because this fire sign is stable. and creating their own stairway, their own path. They fought their battles and they not want to fight anymore. They just want to be at peace. No more argument, no more fighting, no more staying up late at night. And maybe this fire sign has some earth in their chart. This water sign has earth in their chart. So we have air, water, and fire. And earth. Okay, let me clarify this three of cups. Huh. Thank you, spirit. That's judgment. Two tens. Judgment on this third party situation. That's why I have this two options up there at the hand. So we started off with partying with third, third parties. And we got the two options right here. Making a move fast within this relationship. But the outcome is judgment. There is judgment. We're 
maybe an air sign. An air sign, a fire sign. Maybe your intuition is guiding you towards this path. So you won't have to be defensive of this change. The judgment will be rendered in this situation. So from what I see in the next 48, there will be judgment on a situation of a third party, maybe between a water sign, air sign, fire sign, and earth sign. We have all the signs on the table, but definitely fire and air. There's judgment within that situation. Okay, let me give y'all a uh, let me give y'all Oracle card to close out this message for the next forty-eight for my collection. Hmm. So maybe come springtime, you're going to see your seeds grow and plant. Let's see what this card says, guys. Okay, it says, embrace that change is on the horizon. Allow your dreams to become reality. Spring is an exciting time because it has so much potential. Animals are coming out of hibernation. Flowers are pushing up through the sorrow. And the days are getting lighter and brighter. The spring card features a wild hare because a Celtic animal medicine, the hare brings intuition and rebirth. Hares are highly fertile beings and so their medicine can be bring dreams to life. So, this card here has green and purple. This card has green and purple. This card has green. This card has green. And this card has green. So, maybe by the springtime, there will be judgment on this relationship. Maybe you birthed in a new idea within a business. And maybe you have fertility. Maybe you are going to be expecting by the springtime. They say you'll be seeing your seeds grow. Well, guys, remember to like, share comment and subscribe check out my tiktok get me to the thousand subscribers so i can give y'all a free read and with that being said happy holidays to y'all stay safe and i'll see y'all real soon